Was there a meeting between MasterCard and Visa and PayPal and YouTube and Facebook and Twitter? Like, did they, do they have like a, like a WhatsApp group that they're all on? <laughs> or, you know, do they all, you know, they're all on the same call list or email list and they just coordinate? Yeah, Andrew Tate has to go. which on the face of it appears to be blatant misogyny. And when you couple that with your massive influence and huge reach, that is why the social media companies have decided to effectively cancel you. I don't is that true? Like the social media companies, did they cancel Andrew Tate because of misogyny? I think that is um, not true. I think Andrew Tate was canceled because of what he's been saying about uh, COVID what he's saying about lockdowns, what he's been saying about, you know, certain medical treatments. I think he was uh, basically barred from not only social media platforms, but also financially, like certain um, uh, banking platforms canceled, like credit card companies stopped processing payments, uh, PayPal stopped processing payments for Andrew Tate. So that coordinated deplatforming it was not because of blatant misogyny. I think that's just the excuse that's used. That's the cover that's used. But he was talking about, he was criticizing governments. He was criticizing the EU. He's criticizing the US. He is basically also on the issue of Ukraine. He is, you know, going against the um, liberal mainstream. He's going against liberal governments. And that is why they really had to get rid of him. He was going way too viral. And that is like the dangerous thing for the, these powers. Like, why does, like, how, how much misogynistic material is there online? Like, just assuming that Andrew Tate actually is a misogynist, which we'll analyze in a second. But uh, assuming that he is, like, is, is that the reason? No, there's so much misogyny. <laughs> that you can find online. You can find all kinds of misandry, anti-man uh, hate. You know, you can find a lot of that online. But the critical thing that, you know, if you have like a, a misogynistic tweet or a misogynistic video, you might get like one video taken down or the tweet becomes, you know, restricted or whatever. You might get banned from one platform. But for all of the platforms simultaneously to shut him down and financial institutions to shut him down, that shows something much more serious. Uh, so this is this is just a cover for the misogyny is just a cover for the real issues. And of course, Pierce Morgan is not going to want to even open up those issues. He's not even going to want to talk about any of those real hard hitting issues. He just wants to make this to be you know, a debate about is Andrew Tate a misogynist or not. But that's completely missing, like, the most, uh, arguably, like, the most incisive parts of what Andrew Tate puts out. So why doesn't Andrew Tate make that the conversation? Why doesn't Andrew Tate focus on what has happened to him? Like, that's the big news, is him being deplatformed in such an aggressive way across all of these. Who's coordinating? You know, this platform, is there like a meeting? Like, was there a meeting between MasterCard and Visa and PayPal and YouTube and Facebook and Twitter? Like, did they, do they have like a, like a WhatsApp group that they're all on? <laughs> or, you know, do they all, you know, they're all on the same call list or email list and they just coordinate? Yeah, Andrew Tate has to go. Like, who's coordinating that? Is it, is it the White House? We've, it's been revealed recently how much the White House is involved with big tech uh, in censoring anti-government voices. That's the big news. That's the big topic, right? That's what people, that's what the conversation should be about. Andrew Tate is not taking advantage of that on this huge platform that he's been given with Pierce Morgan. And, it, and the whole conversation or the whole name of Pierce Morgan's uh, show is Uncensored. So why aren't they talking about censorship? They just want to talk about misogyny.